utensils inserted into hot food or other type, which means you take your spoon, a dairy spoon, and you stir your chicken soup in it, or vice versa, what happens then? Same thing. You have to know, you have chicken soup in the pot. You have to know if the spoon is ben yomo or eno ben yomo. If the spoon is ben yomo, then you have over here, you just use the spoon within hot milk to, to stir the hot milk. On clearishon, the spoon becomes ben yomo. When you stir now the meat, the flavor, the taste goes into the meat, into the chicken soup and makes it a soup. You need to have 60 times that spoon, which usually you don't, because a spoon within a milk pot, you don't have 60 times, it's just not the ratio. If the spoon wasn't used for 24 hours with hot, then you don't have a problem, because it doesn't have the ability to make the meat pot a soup in any way, the, 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 the chicken soup a soup in any way. What about the chicken soup to the spoon? Yes, that will make it now absorbed with the meat. And since with chicken, since it's a dairy spoon, you'll have to have a gala on such a spoon. And same thing would be with any other uh, utensil that you would use into hot food of the other type.